Hello, Bravna. Hello, everybody. Uh, it's your boys, you, you, and Prime. We're we're back. We're we're at it again. Up to our usual shenanigans. <sighs> oh, sure or, are. Or today's case, Shanghaiigans. Hmm. Mm-mm-mm. Uh, yeah, so it's like that. Good slide whistle sound effect would fit there. I can't do it. Nope. I don't have magical lips. I just got these magic fingers. <laughs> That's a joke for the ladies. <laughs> or the fellas. That's and true. the they-thems. That's true. I mean, I'm gonna wear a finger condom regardless, so yeah, I'll put it wherever. A finger condom. Do they have names? Gloves? No, the, for your, the finger ones. Yeah, gloves? Are they just, they're just called gloves? I thought gloves en encapsulated your whole hand. I guess it's a finger glove? <laughs> yeah, saying that out loud actually <laughs> makes sense. I like finger condom better. It's the same thing. Fits the shape. I feel like a condom finger is a, glove is sounds a like a, a little glove that you stick on the tip of your finger. Like a miniature mitten for that last little knuckles worth yeah, of that covers your well, nail. That would be a finger hat. <laughs> ah, tomato, tomato, or my a finger, friend. Finger glove. Before the Japanese army gets here. Okay, so this is like. Japanese army is on their way here and this was how long ago 20 years no we're in the present again really yeah I just talked to Margaret at the bottom of the end oh shit I'm not paying attention no Supitani. looks like Eminem ah like Bear Grylls no Oh, he doesn't really look like anything to me. Uh, Brock opened his eyes. Brock. From, Poke oh, from, from Pokemon. Pokemon. I guess, yeah, without his, like, Lisa Simpson haircut. Yeah. Like a more human rendition of him. Or the bad guy from Lethal Weapon 2. Lethal Weapon 4. Oh. Haven't seen either. <laughs> no. Yeah, we I mean, really you haven't seen any of them. That was crazy that I guessed like the same line of movies though. He looks like Joey Harrington is who he looks like. Nobody's gonna know who he is without a Google search. No, what's a Joey Harrington? Uh we'll let you Google search it too for the magic. That's not magical, tell me. I want to know. He, I want instant gratification. He was a quarterback for the Lions. Oh, here we go. In, uh, I want to say early 2000s, probably like 02, 03, somewhere in there. Swear to God, I'm going to have to pull up a picture of him now, though, so you can see it. Yeah, let's see. I'll tell you all if it's worth a Google. If it's worth worth a quick Goog. Yeah, worth get, get it in the Goog. That's how you find things. Here in the future. Play some future music there. Uh. A little bit. A little bit. <laughs> when we uh, see yeah, it come kinda, up yeah. again, it's pretty close. For the style of art it is. Let's see, let's be careful. Yeah. That's pretty close, it's, actually. It's yeah. close enough that yeah. people will look at it and say, "Hey, kinda, yeah." Yeah, I would. Yeah, it's worth a gook. What's what's that? What's that bra's name? Joey Harrington. Joey Harrington and Lieutenant Sukatani. Sukatani. I like I like it more of like a Sukatani. Italian. Welcome, a, welcome a to a Sukatani's. How the fuck did he end up in the Japanese military? He's a chef. Yeah. <laughs> My mama, she's a half a Japanese. Yeah. He's in uh, Ratatouille's Brigade. Right. <laughs> I love that fucking mouse. I would die for that mouse. Yep. <laughs> so what do you... He makes the best, best damn brioche. 
I've ever had in my life. You ever had a bouquet? Forget about it. Make you a chicken noodle soup that'll suck the dysentery right out of you. <laughs> We are, yeah, we're thick in the plot, boys. Uh, but not like the fun plot that involves us. This is like all the military background. It he is important, him. but at the same time, it really doesn't matter. You, We all know how this war ended. <laughs> Where is the white taiga? Wuhan, more precisely, it's sealed inside the temple ruins on the edge of Wuhan. Oh snaps. Of course, Dehuai knows this. Yeah. Well, yeah. He found the other three before you knew he was collecting them? Yeah. Yeah. It, it, my boy knew. Yes. He knows where the legendary birds live, and he, he knows how to summon Lugia. He's already caught three of them. Right. You're he way just behind. needs the last one. Yep. He is the master trainer. He's red standing upon the mountain. Are these monsters protecting the white tiger? Apparently, Dehuai got his ass kicked by him, too. I mean. Oh, that's not good, because I wouldn't mess with Dehuai. That's how we do. I've just had an idea. An idea? I didn't see no light bulb. I've got it. They get question marks, but they don't get light bulbs. What is this? Yep. We'll give the kid a pass and let him in the games. Then in the next round, you can take them both out. Hoodlum Khan. What the hell? My old man money ain't good enough here? Wow. This establishment's uh, bar, bar enthusiast. Nobody wants to see an old guy try to get a hard on at the show. That's, I don't think that's this kind of show. You don't think a lady's gonna come out here in a sexy outfit and sing to these guys in this no, dive it bar? Be, it could be a juggler. Oh, like a magician? Yeah. <laughs> it's like an open mic situation. Yeah, Lance Burton's gonna come out here. Mind freak. <laughs> like, oh, this guy again. Bartender 1010 pours him out for Yan Yan. There we go. Or his dicks out. Dicks out for Yen Yen. Yeah, Epson for Chad Yen Yen. for the starving parrot. This place changed hands ages ago. They're beating around the bush, kid. Oh, see, pretty lady's gonna come out and play the violin. Oh wow! I do. As soon as I saw it, I remembered it. That's not a violin, I don't think. No, I'm not going to try and pronounce it. You've the grown instrument. into a beautiful young woman, Kuihua. It's basically a violin. Since I saw you last, I would imagine just the sound of your playing uh, has become so much richer. I think the strings are tuned. So, different. what do you think, Zhen? Why is it that the march of time, the endless rising and setting of the one. sun, has to be so no, I, I want to say it's it's almost like spoken poetry. It's not quite exposition. <laughs> At any rate, Jen, here I am, back in Shanghai. I intend to clean things up once and for all. The legacy of Hyuga, who oh, passed on so long ago. Well, perhaps next time. Said, other than it doesn't look like her hand's in the right place sometimes, I honestly can't really tell if that's a that's like a FMV, like that's a real lady playing that right now. Oh, I don't think so. I think it is a CGI lady. Yeah, but yeah. It, like for the lighting and everything, it's really hard to tell. That actually could be a real lady they recorded doing this. It did look like her hand was behind where it should have been sometimes. Right, and things right. Things like that, though. And I said, in her face, honestly, did look kind of like a computer game. I mean, I don't know about you, but we could be looking at real people right now. 
at how fine these graphics are. Look at that round edge of the platform she's standing on. Yeah, I couldn't tell. The smooth. <laughs> I can smell the marble from here. <laughs> Uncle Zhuzhen. Hell yeah, girl. Alright. Here to borrow some more money. Big Papa. Quinoa. Kiwi. Kiwa. 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 That's why I said quinoa. <laughs> but isn't that like a bean or rice? I guess it's quinoa. It's it's a quinoa. It's its own thing. Is it a legume? <laughs> that I don't know enough about legumes to dispute it. So we'll go with yeah. Well, is it like a peanut or like a potato? <laughs> oh, dude, I've, I don't even think I've ever eaten uh, quinoa. Yeah, had one in my mouth. I feel like they keep it next to the rice and stuff at the grocery store. Oh, here he is. Wugwai? Woo yeah, coming back to... No, no, uh, his Mr. Zen. Oh, Zhang Zhen Zhen. Hong Kong oh, Fui. he's here to beg. Sad face. Oh, so that's... Zhu Zhen's boy? Yeah, so that's why. Or no, that's his brother, I guess. If that's her, his daughter, and she's... Zhu Zhen is her uncle. Holy right, shit, father. that was hard to uncle say. Uncle Zhu Zhen is back. Mr. Shen. Or they're not related. They're alive, but how? Yeah, she could just call him uncle. Yeah, old friend. I'm pretty sure it was his brother. He'd be okay. like, brother! Bruh! Bruh. Oh, I change hands. Well, yeah, I'm, I'm broke as a motherfucker. Got hooked on opiates. You ever had opiates? You're like, like, oh yeah. Yeah. I've been known to snoot the cat, the cat, and the cat's meow. Yep. I got stuck on cat for a minute. <laughs> My brain just locked in. Got this new shit called the pet cat's pajamas. The pet cat, pet cat's pajamas. Yeah, the cat pets. That's the brand. Cat Pat PJs. <laughs> or PJ Pat Cat. That, now you're just in DJ territory. Right. It's turning into a Parappa the Rappa song. <laughs> He's back from Calvin. Yes. Please leave Uncle Zushin alone. Uncle Zushin's gonna stomp some butt in if he keeps talking to me like that. Master Wugwai? Wugui? Wugui! He's <laughs> like a, a Rick and Morty character. <laughs> What's Roger's little baby alien? An American Dead? Doesn't it have a name like that? Oh, it does. Like Oogway? No. Uh, it. Don't think about it, it'll come. Title of your sex tape. <laughs> Stop saying that word. <laughs> <laughs> Title of your fornication film. There you go. <laughs> now it's educational. Now it's educational. <laughs> if you use at least a three syllable word in the title, it's educational. Yes. It takes away that extra. Yeah, just immediately you get sponsored by who were those guys? DC? Yeah. <laughs> Did the, like, the educational books and the little videos we watched in school. Got sponsored by Deke. That's D-I-C. They did the Sonic show. Didn't I think they, they did like Sailor a, Moon did, as well. Yeah, I was gonna say, they did Sailor for, Moon. They did Sailor Moon for a little while. Or for Power little Rangers? Bit. I think it was uh, the end of Power Rangers. It might have been. Or is that just Saban? Saban, Sabin, Saiban, Psyduck. Cyberman. Oh, he man, the first hit, he just pokes that thing right in the crank. And does no damage. Yeah. I guess I should just go straight Magi. He's gonna flash flood the fire, the fire sage. In the face! Oh, 17 damage, that wasn't bad. That was no hydro pump. Ooh, can't you poison him? No. No, I think I can just light him on fire, what's, but he's throwing water, so. What's the Skiroko Blast? Um, sriracha. It's that's all it is. Just two bottles of sriracha. 
I'm just right in the eyes. <laughs> is it a damaging ability or is it a buff? It's probably a debuff. Oh, it makes all your food damage. taste bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it makes you skip your next turn, head right to the nearest Chipotle and overpay. Yeah, you... <laughs> for a burrito. Uh, if you disagree, you know, change your minds in the chat. Why is sriracha good? Because I think it makes everything taste bad. And oh, it's fire class to the Restores insane. HP and cures paralysis. Man, that's expensive, though, that nourishing potion. My goodness. Well, they're saying, I'm not your healer, bitch. But I'll do it for a fee. Yeah. We don't want you to heal with Zhuzhen, because then Alice gets kicked out of the party. There we go. Oh, nuked. Yeah, you twirly, can... twirly, twirly. Being stingy with the MP, like I used to be, like the, the previous playthroughs I had of this game when I was a lot younger. It's a lot better just to just to blow blast. That. Yeah, just, yeah. Just burn holes through everything. Well, especially with things like, for Yuri's Death Emperor fusion being that it can leech mana, like when you're out fighting even some of the bosses because they have like we said like M infinite MP. You can always get MP from them. So essentially, Yuri could be a little mana battery for himself. Only if he's in the Death Emperor one, though. Right. Because you can't... We did get the Flare Brooch, which reduces the cost of fusions by, what was it, like 20% or something? Yeah. So I think you can get another fusion in the same battle, but then you only get, like, five or six total turns it, it before he goes berserk. It was never preserved. worth it for me. Like, I never found myself in a suit. Like, if I did get close to that, I would, I would just understand that I used the wrong fusion. You're like, oh, okay, this is not the fusion I should have used. I should have just went with that one. You can always use, like, the better SP items, but I don't know. I never found it worth it. If I died, I died. No. And then I yeah. would just not use that fusion on that I fight. I said it's, it's, yeah, it's generally not worth it at all to, like, fusion hop. Yeah, oh, uh, whoops, he's, he's water? I'm dead. All right, next time, I'm using light. <laughs> right. Yeah, not not chasing each other's tails around this fire puts water out but water puts fire out but fire evaporates water but but they're both out simultaneously <laughs> yeah uh, what are we doing next buddy I'm, I'm getting this bar back it's gonna be my bar now now you face me and then that yeah, girl calling yeah, me yeah. uncle's gonna work for me I'm gonna be your boss your magic has no I'm effect a, on I'm me. I'm gonna pay her a fair wage. I'm gonna I'm gonna break these glass ceilings. Cause I am Zushin. So magic really doesn't work at all in this guy. I don't know. Maybe. That might do something. I do know it healed him when you use magic with uh, old Ben. Oh, Ben Kenobi. Oh, Benny boy. That would suck if the fire on the staff now heals him for that little bit. Damn, doll seam up in here. Mr. Fantastic. Yeah. What the hell? Damn it. In the nuts. I pushed it, just not hard enough. No, he's just wailing on that guy's crotch. Uh, I should probably heal, right? I guess you could see how much HP that does. Better off saving that. Nice. Yep. Pretty good. Fire stick does look cool. It does. I imagine it's hot as a bitch. It kind of reminds me of Darth Maul, like a lot. Oh yeah. Damn. Damn. Yep. Yeah. I think about it and then it happens and I'm just like, ah, oh, why to think about it? But here we are again. So now I'm scared, now it's just all good. So now I'm gun shy. <laughs> Ew. Oh, he's blocking. Oh. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, doing like no damage to this guy. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Like, I don't like this. Um. Uh oh. Are you serious? 
Is that supposed to happen? Hopefully that's scripted. Yeah, looks pretty scripted. Alrighty, good, good. Cheap, but I'll allow it. <sighs> you magic sucking half pint slick back bastard. God dang. You yellow bellied lily livered son of a one eyed prairie dog. <laughs> Oh, no, he went one step further. He's going to chainsaw massacre him. Wow. He's going to cut him up, serve him to Dehuai. Uh, they're just going to eat him up. So him and Dehuai into some kinky stuff. Eat him up like fish sticks. What are you doing, Pops? Thought you were eating pot stickers? Mm -hmm. Wish I was eating pot stickers. Right. Hey, Yuri, Yuri, stay on track, stay on track. Bleeding out on the floor. This, this guy, guy deathed did this me. To you? Yeah, I don't like watching other people beat you up. That's my job. Yeah, only I get to beat up old people around here. That's the only reason it's okay. <laughs> like, at least he stops us from getting beat up by everyone. So now it's just like one guy kind of takes the brunt of most of it. <laughs> right. He leans heavy towards Jerry. <laughs> if you go shopping at the same time as Jerry, probably not going to be you that day. <laughs> Yuri just, like, opens the door. He's like, all right, Jerry. It's time, and he's like, oh, hey, Yuri. Hey, you're looking swell today. And <laughs> just, just bubbles him. Yeah, why would I tell you who I is? <laughs> you really are dumb. Screw you, man. What an amusing joke. Let's Roger Bacon his ass. Let's just punch his face in. Oh, yeah. This guy deserves it. Woo goo eye. Yeah, we got our brass knucks on. Oh, we're starting out right out the gate with that one, huh? That's cool. Nice. Miss. Ooh. Yeah, I guess we don't have a. Uh... My oh. skill didn't Ooh. work. Protected by the darkness. Bitch, I am the darkness. Turns into Batman. Yeah. <laughs> but then he's got to start using the deep voice. Yeah. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, no, we'll just we'll just slap you around. Yeah. We'll just poke you in the eyes. Let the little girl you are. And drill kick you. Chicka chicka cha. It's like the kung fu equivalent of rolling your R's. The drill the spin kick. kick like yeah. yeah the drill kick. <laughs> That or the the rapid machine gun punch he does is the fire one. <laughs> yeah. Oh. The hell? Bad breath. Yeah, just halitosis to me. You gotta floss now after you're learning your something. meals. Yeah, now you're learning something. He should have realized he was done as soon as Yuri turned into this. He's like, oh shit. Yep. Why is the old man is always friends with one of these guys. This is exactly what happened 20 yeah, years exactly. ago. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. I kicked his ass and then some, some crazy He turned into guy. a dark demon monster too and kicked the shit out of me. Aww. I can do that exact attack. It's not gonna... Come on, buddy. Yeah, you gotta at least try, Woo Goo Eye. Mm. Oh. Yep, kicked him right in the neck, all the way to the ground. Yeah. He didn't die, hit, though. Hit him in the C4. Uh, he ain't gonna be walking anytime soon. Got a weird model. It's kind of weird. Some more, <laughs> some more darkness. Some more darkness in our pocket. Oh yeah, you best believe this fusion. Everybody's in here just Tim Tebowing. <laughs> so Tebow stole it from Zhuzhen. Zhuzhen was the original Tebower. Yeah, we should call it Zhuzhening. Uh, sounds a little 
racing. Yeah, it's a lot harder to say, too. It doesn't have that ring to it. Yeah, I wouldn't catch on in America. No. Especially not at church. Yeah, no. We, we have things like Rick Rolling, for God's sakes. Yeah. Alliteration sells here. I think Zuzian's. Zuzian's kind of alliteration. Yeah. Technically one name, but, you know, the sound repeats. Arg. Dude's a pirate the whole time. Something, on my, <laughs> something on my face. Yeah, blood. Yeah. His mouth. Yep. That mouth, though. Putting two and two together. Making that four. He's crying. What should I do? Back away slowly. Back away slowly. <laughs> if he reaches you for your tits, right, you gotta fight him off. Kid's name is Yuri. No known last name. It's a memento uh -huh. from Colonel Ben Hugo. Who to what now? You knew my daddy? Oh, oh, my life ever since I accompanied his travels. We opened up shop in Shanghai. That that's feels like a, a pretty overused story. Like, me and your dad went in business together, you see. Oh yeah, went on a journey. I told you this is this is the guy before Lord Braska. Right. <laughs> this is this is their squad. <laughs> They're after the final Aeon. That's what Deathwise after. Pretty much, yeah. He's trying to be Unaleska. It checks out. And we're not letting him. And Roger Baker and is Seymour. <laughs> right. <laughs> my mother died. Yeah, <laughs> but that's just my luck. <laughs> Mobs die, man. <laughs> I see you've coped with it in a healthy way. Right. And how happy Zhuzhen must be as well. Well, Zhuzhen can keep a secret. Yeah, no more lies, Zhuzhen. Yeah. Secret, secret. He's got a secret. Tell me, you stupid old man. Oh, he's not calling him Pops no more. Yeah, come on, Yuri. Just backhands, Alice. This is Pops we're talking about. Mm -hmm. Don't touch my arm, Alice. I was the one who killed Hugo. What? I don't believe that. Shushan. Did you see what Hugo turned into? He definitely did not yeah, kill Hugo. there's Hugen. no way. But you're, you don't even know the guy. He got fucking punked by Wu Guai. First I met you, 15, oh, 15, not 15. 20. We were close. A special assassin sent to China. Yeah, and I killed him with my wooden staff and my one fire ability I had when you met me. <laughs> He did come with that one, huh? He didn't level up and learn that one the after the first fight. The dance? Yeah. yeah. That's right. He's talking about your father. Put his life on the line, stop the curse. There's that word again. Valorization. So he sacrificed himself. It's starting to remind me a little more like Final Fantasy X. I was going to say Titan A.E. Oh, man, how many people have seen that movie, though? I would guarantee all seven people who watch this <laughs> have seen it it's and know exactly what I'm talking about. When I saw it at like the Walmart five dollar bin, I bought it immediately. Oh and yeah, forced uh, my girlfriend to watch it, and uh, man, she was <laughs> she was like, "That was all right." I was like, what? <laughs> yeah, blasphemy. I like Brother Bear. I'm like what? <laughs> yep. Oh, I get that a lot, too. I like it because of Phil Collins. No. <laughs> Phil Collins, huh? I'm in love with Brian Adams. <laughs> Man, I don't know. I, Bachman Turner Overdrive is like the closest I can get to something like that. For a movie? Like like in a movie because of the soundtrack? No, just like that style of like old school rock and roll type deal. Oh. 
Is Phil Collins even rock and roll? Is like uh, white people R and B. I would say rock and roll because he was in Genesis, is what they were called before, right? Yeah, not a big fan of Genesis. It was it was similar they got, like, to a your song. your what Deep Purple and Jefferson Airplane. We built the city. Right. Is that Who Jefferson is? Airplane? We built the city. I have no idea. I don't know either. Yeah, I couldn't tell you. But Jefferson Airplane, I know, then became Jefferson Starship, didn't they? Is that how that works? Is that the same people? I think so. Kind of like John Mellencamp became John Cougar Mellencamp, and then he was John Cougar, and then he went back to John Cougar Mellencamp, and he couldn't make up his fucking mind. Well, it's like when, uh... And everybody already just called him John. <laughs> so it's like when that, that guy got kicked out of Metallica, so he formed Corn, and now he just, like seizes up on the mic and goes no I'm not gonna do it <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not gonna do it <laughs> might pull something who is the other guy in Genesis with Phil Collins it wasn't it Peter Gabriel it's the other one I really like I do like some Peter Gabriel songs oh no no not a fan oh no oh, absolutely man. not the closest I can get to letting a man like love in my ears is Meatloaf uh, anything softer than Sting? Me, no way. Oh yeah, man. Oh yeah. Uh, it does nothing. F I'm doesn't not, Sting sing? Uh, what is that? Fields of Gold. I'm not white. That one enough. doesn't make you cry a little bit no. every time you hear it. Oh man. No. You're just. You're just. I'm. I don't know. I lived on the streets too long. Mm -hmm. I belong to the streets. And that's some like. Oh, so you listen to the song that the girl cowgirl sings in Toy Story 2? What? No. <laughs> On repeat, baby. That's what I go to sleep. To. <laughs> yeah, exactly. No, I grew up on like weird stuff, like Pink Floyd. So like, I look on that more fondly than like Peter Gabriel. I, I just no one ever listened to that around me. So like, the first time I listened to Peter Gabriel was probably like sixteen. I was like, ah, oh. at the end of Wally. -E. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like listening to like System of a Down at this time in my life, and then I sit down I'm like, what's Peter Gabriel? Oh, nope. No, nope. two seconds mood. into it? No. Nope. Yeah, not in the mood. Yeah, I want to listen to this guy scream about how we shouldn't have built a prison. Mm -hmm. Sister of Down like, still rocks my socks every once in a while. The obsession's gone, but I, I fondly remember some songs. It was a simpler time. It was a better time. <laughs> right. Those guys were geniuses. For their time period. Like, they were just... They were exactly what, like, people like me needed in that time period. Just, like, raw, angsty music that had, like, undertones we would never understand. Right. Until you were, yeah. Yeah, way like, older, and you're like, oh, shit. Researching candidates about who you're going to vote for. Yeah. <laughs> and realize just how big the world is. And you really start taking stock of things. Yeah, right now we got this Russian-Ukraine thing going on. That's crazy. Russia's getting them cheeks clapped. As they should. You know, you can't just you can't just invade people like that, bruh. There's ways to do things, and it's called Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> you have a Yu-Gi-Oh battle on top of, like, two skyscrapers that are close enough that you can hear each other. And the loser just goes home. So, like, you know, you, you lay down, like, the new outline of Russia. You're like, if I win this duel, I get X amount of land. And Ukraine's like, and what are your cards? But if I win this duel, peace treaty for the next 150 years. Boom. And Putin's like, all right. He pops his Kaiba collar and he just like smiles because he knows he's got three blue eyes, white dragons in his deck. And, then, and he know, stacked his deck because it's Putin. Well, yeah, of course. He's not going to play fair. The, and then he'll be like, that's my deck gimmick. Yeah. Like, that's. <laughs> and he'll like, his top card is like. The user's allowed to pre-stack this deck. Right, <laughs> that's exactly. That's just his card. Yep, I said that's his... That's his. It's like shittily made, too. Mm. Like, it's like cut out from yeah. like newspaper The clippings. rules say I can build a deck. I built this deck. Yeah, but you have to shuffle them at the beginning of the game, Putin. Not according yeah, to I this didn't. card. I shuffled it back there. <laughs> I shuffled it before I built it. <laughs> <laughs> You've triggered my trap by telling me to shuffle my deck. <laughs> I can instinctively not shuffle my <laughs> yes. deck. Yes. Like, I've never yeah. heard of that card. Yeah. Well, you can't hear of every card. You can't just know all the cards, buddy, alright? 
This is a game of trust as much as it is dual monsters. Yeah. Like, Alright, oh, it doesn't sorry. seem right, but okay. I thought this was a kid's game that involved some form of imagination. <laughs> <laughs> this is supposed to be fun. Aren't we having fun? <laughs> Settle down, Putin. This is a kid's game. <laughs> Oh man, I wish. Oh, I wish. Like, well, then let hell. me use my custom cards. <laughs> How much better would this fucking world be if we solved all of our problems with a like, dual disc? Yes. Oh my god, how great would that be? And the presidential election is about to begin. <laughs> First up, we'll hear from each candidate, and then we'll have the press conference, and then we end with the the electoral duel. <laughs> right. Oh man, that would be so tight. Every year, that the candidates. sporting events are like the Olympics. It's just people out there with dual discs competing in the events. Oh, it'd be one event at yeah. least. Like, hey, like we're doing the javelin throw. I summon Guy of the Fierce Knight, and he's gonna get a running start on his horse and just launch this fucking lance. I like the idea that it's just like dueling is integrated in there. It's like fencing, then dueling, right? And then you have like the ski, the the ski downhill thing, and then you have the ski downhill while during a duel. Mm -hmm. Like, there's just dual aspects of all of it. And then you turn uh, curling into Beyblades. Because I would watch the hell out of that. Everybody would. Yeah, who Absolutely. wouldn't watch that? Oh, yeah, we already know who you are. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. They come out there with, like, couch cushions strapped to their ankles, though. <laughs> I mean, I, I think I imagine it would be like a uh, what is it called? Uh, battle bots? Is that what that's called? Yeah. Yeah, where they like make a, the little go kart yeah, robot like things little, to fight, and they got hang a little out behind cage. The gas. Yeah. So you have like slots in each side of the cage that your broom handles fit through, so you can kind of broom it up. All right, so now we go here. We're going. We're going for that white tiger. <laughs> no, two guys on your team have the brooms, and the guy in the middle has like a riot shield there you to go. keep it from bouncing into your guy's ankles, and you got a broom around his shield. But I guess the the curling, whatever the thing is called, what is the it? A stone. Puck? The stone. Curling stone. I guess it would have to be shaped more like a top, like a dreidel. Oh yeah, because you gotta let it rip. So instead of a instead of a broom, they'd have like little forks to put oh, the so bottom like, of the top spinning around, so it keeps spinning, but they can steer it. Then it just turns into the Mister My Mini game, where the two guys with the the tower shields are just oh, bapping yeah, that just thing bat. back and forth. It's like pinball on ice. Yeah, I like my version of Winter Olympics. The dual disc. Yeah, I think there's potential in that. Yes. Well, especially if we get fucking Sonic and Mario to show up. Then it's blast and a half. Alright, this music. Creepy town. This music, I remember just, you know, being a youngin. Walking in here and I was like, man, this is like pretty cool. And then I get a couple steps in and I was like, alright, it's making me a little nervous. Mm -hmm. And I'm walking through, and I'm like, all right, I'll, I want to go home now. Yeah, I'm this not having fun anymore. <laughs> yeah, this is clearly not uh, a cool temple. This is a temple at night where uh, people are probably, you know, dead. Ooh, treasure chest. Talisman of Mercy. It'd be a lot cooler if it was a talisman of luck. Well, Mercy, is that the same thing but better? I don't think I so. I doubt it. No, I think it was, like... Improves your intelligence or some, some schniz. Give it, give it a good savey. Little, little savey wavy. Right. Are you a shop? No, you're yeah. just yeah. You're the pretty bumbling subordinate. Uh, oh. which did we get weapons at that oh, last time with Weebling? Are you? Oh, he was telling me there's a shop. All right, yeah. I'm sorry. What'd you say? Did we get new weapons when we were at the town where Lily was from? Yeah, but I mean... I say, I feel like we're due for I, I some want new some weapons. More, I want some more talismans of luck. I feel like we're due for uh, running into the acupuncture guy, too. I really just need it for Margaret. Mm. 
I haven't gone that senile yet. I said yet. Like there is portions of my life where I can tell I'm losing it though. Right. Oh Zushin. Do me a favor and uh don't talk about that shit. Yep. <laughs> Bottle it up, buddy. Yeah. Shove it deep. That, that inside opioid you. addiction from twenty years ago. Kinda did a number on me. <laughs> I'm paying for it now. Kid, if you would have seen me back then, you wouldn't have believed it. I would have booped your <laughs> boop just for a little bit of catnip. <laughs> just to see it, really. Just for a, just for a pinch of cat powder. Mm-hmm. See, go away, you're distracting me. I'm sorry. He's, yep, he's reaching in his pocket and digging out the cat powder. Yeah, I can't do this In his little pocket, him. in his little pocket mirror, his little pocket watch, he's getting ready to sneak it out of there. He's like, I can't do this on an empty nostril. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot easier to do this with hornets in my brain. Alright, um... I imagine you guys are still just Still doing the same thing. Yeah. Uh, But she's with the Japanese army. Uh, Yeah, but she's like with us now. We're trying to figure out how to stop the Hawaii. I think the Japanese army is just kind of doing their own thing. Alright, alright. Where am I going? I guess back the way you came. I thought there was a way to trigger something. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yep, can't leave old Zhuzhen behind. But I did all the things. Maybe I just bug him. <sighs> Zhuzhen, I've... You can't go over to the right there? Nope. I've exhausted all my options. Is there, like, a way to, like... Can we go around, Lieutenant Colonel? Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh damn it! I thought I saw something over there. Nope. It almost, no. Yes, don't do it, it almost again. looks like there's a little ramp there. No. Oh there we go. There we go. Yeah, you know, sometimes it's just better to use the D-pad. Yeah, I can't. Let me know when you need them. Show me, Show what, me you what you got. got. That's not bad. I got two of them. I don't have any studded caps. That's good stuffs. Western belt, I thought we should have. Or no, I guess we got the casual belt because we had, like, the leather belt. Yeah. I hope we don't miss it. Oh, close. But it's I. Right. I like to ride the edge. <laughs> How much is a Leonardo's bear? Thirty-three thirty. That's not terrible. Sure I feel know. like we're gonna find one though. I honestly feel like we're gonna find one in here. Yeah, or at least find one before we need one. I don't remember ever buying one before in my life, so yeah. I don't think we need it, need it. Bam. There we go. A little cleaner of a hit. Cure silence, I might be really having some. Just in case. You never know. It's never too late to be safe. Uh, that should be good. We're good. We're Gucci. Alright, 
Still nothing from you. Let's go bug Zushin again. You're gonna tell us to piss off again. Nah, he's surely he's figured something out by now. Here we go. Alright. I get it. He just blows it up. Yep, here goes. Yep, there he goes. KO Ken times ten. Key, yeah. Five, he just punched five it. Five ring shattering. Here we go. That's where they got the idea for summon four gods. Right? <laughs> that um, whole four gods of direction thing. Should we go down there? It's 45 minutes. Uh, no. We should leave them in suspense. Alrighty. And maybe, maybe there's rumblings. There might be a pole in the field. Looking to see, uh, now that we got, what, four party members? Yeah. See, uh, who the fans like. If they want us to keep rolling with who we've got. Alice, Margaret, Yuri. Or if they... Maybe they're liking Zhuzhen. He's come through in two boss fights. Or do we just save Zhuzhen for the boss fight? Uh, I don't even remember how to change my characters. I don't think we can yet. Well, Zhuzhen, I guess, is... Yeah, I don't think we can. Hanging out? Know? Yeah, he's he's still kind of a loner right now. What's on page two? Is there not a party one, I guess? Oh, that page two. Yeah, noob score and line break. And it's not... It should be formation. I thought it was formation. Yeah. And, like, selecting them just moves them, yeah, front or back. Yep. I guess, technically, we don't have Shushan in the party right now. So, no poles. Never but, mind. you know, one day, one day we'll, we'll have that pole. And, and you'll all be like, hot it's a damn. nice pole. This is this is interaction at its finest. This is the polinist poll I ever yeah. done. You, top three poles: uh, North Pole, South Pole, and this motherfucking pole. This pole. Uh, but yeah, that'll do it for for Big seventy-two inch pole. What is the what is this episode? Is this episode nine? No, this should be ten. This is ten. This should be this should be the the big season finale. The big ones here. That will not. We're not. This is not a season finale. What's the end of season one? I ten uh, episodes a season. I feel like that. Oh, and then so we'll like finish the this one sometime next year, twenty twenty three. Catch you later, nerds. <laughs> no. Yeah, you we'll, guys we'll could have this up. finished by then. We'll keep this up for you know until it's done. It, honestly, it's gonna go by a lot smoother. Uh, we're kind of finally getting out of like the real prologue area, uh, especially with like Dehuai and all him like stirring up all this all this mischief, getting getting mad at the Zushin. Oh, I do feel like we're gonna start hitting a uh, a definite shift in like more combat to dialogue uh balance i feel like we're gonna start having more battles going on yeah, and less of the yeah, more game uh mickey mouse club meetings yeah yeah it'll be good we're all gonna love it um so yeah we'll, we'll talk to you guys later catch you on the flip side all right bye bye